What is up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. I am the tech teacher and here we cover all things tech, whether that be tutorials, product reviews, or tips. So if any of that interests you, go ahead and subscribe down below. And also don't forget to turn on your, no your notifications or subscriptions so that you don't miss any future uploads. Now today I'm gonna be walking you through the process of setting up the Xbox Cloud Gaming Suite on your iPhone or iOS device. This is super cool because once you get this set up, it only takes about two or three minutes and then you can play a bunch of Xbox games, the full release games, just over the cloud. You don't have to download anything to your phone. You don't have to have an Xbox um, Series X or other tied to the phone. It's completely just your phone as long as you have Game Pass and a, um, an Xbox account, obviously, then you would be good to go. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get into the tutorial. Alright guys, the very first thing you're going to want to do is go to a, the website xbox.clock.com slash play and you're going to get a landing page that looks like this. Um, it might have you sign in, you just want to click on the button to sign in and then you will end up on this page right here. You just want to go ahead and um, make sure you're doing it in Safari so that you can tap on this add to home screen and add a quick bookmark to your home screen so you'll be able to get to it nice and quick. You see we have it here go ahead and click into that bookmark that you just created and sign into your Microsoft account and once you're signed in guys it's that easy we are in we have the app on our phone and since it's cloud gaming you don't have to download anything all these games are ready to go so let me just go ahead and load up forza horizon 4 and show you guys how that's gonna run i'm also gonna be playing off of my um xbox series elite 2 controller And here we are guys, loaded up into the full game. In just a few short minutes. This game is, I think, 99 gigabytes on my PC. I'm not sure exactly how much on the Xbox, but this is no small game. It is really amazing what Microsoft is trying to do. All right, guys, and as you see, we Welcome have loaded back, up Red. the actual full game. No, though it might not run the absolute smoothest, especially a game like this where timing really matters because it's a racing game. <laughs> It's still very usable, it's not absolute garbage at all. And please forgive me, I have no idea how to play this game on controller. As you know if you follow the channel, I have only played this game on the racing wheel before. So I have no clue what the controls are, I'm basically just holding down on the gas and seeing how far we can get with that. But as you can see guys, it's, it's running, it's pretty smooth, it's pretty responsive. There's just a little bit of lag here and there, but for the most part, I can, I can sit down and I can actually play this for a while. So they also have a couple different buttons up here. This monitor is your, um, your network, it lets you know if, if stuff is getting slow. The three buttons over here, you can get feedback and quit the game. And then you just have the regular old Xbox button here as well if you want to go through that. 
and keep in mind this is still a beta so you are bound to run into a few bugs here and there and that's also why they ask all these different questions when you're um when you're loading up into this because they want to get better and slowly improve the game so let me just take you guys into one more game just to show you um how things run and i'm gonna go ahead and go with Injustice 2, why not? So it's literally just as simple as tapping on the game you want to play. Sure, it takes a couple minutes to set up, but you have to keep in mind that these are full length games that they are actually they are streaming just over the cloud straight to your phone. You don't need an Xbox tethered to it or anything. It's just the phone running this completely by itself, which is crazy to even think of. as you can see in just a few short seconds we are loading up the game yep, and as you can see this is the full game i'm full disclosure i've never actually played this game before fighting games aren't my forte so Please forgive me if I'm spamming a lot. I just want to show you guys that this is the full game and it's actually working fairly well, I might add. All right, let's go ahead and quit that. And just like that, you are back at the home screen and you can jump right into another game. All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. If you did enjoy the video or learn anything new, go ahead and drop a like down below. It helps the channel out more than you understand. And also leave a comment down below for any future ideas for videos that you may want to see, or maybe any product reviews or tutorials, anything like that. So guys, as always, thanks for watching and have a good day.